what it is, and somebody you know can can bring up the uh, the things that that sort of drive somebody crazy. So I try to come up with uh, with a list each week of uh, things that make me say, "Oh cripes," and you got to be kidding me, and come on. So, because I find myself saying those things quite quite often, you know, driving down the road shockingly. or something happens. Yeah, shockingly, <laughs> I, uh, I end up using those phrases, and so uh, so I like to include them on the on the radio show with just a little, you know, like. Ah, oh, there's still a lot of work to do in this world because we want this to be positive, hopeful, uh, hopeful religious conversation. That's why we call it religious radio. That's not quite right, part of the reason. And uh, and so, so there's some things that kind of get me going. <clears throat> so I'm going to start with my come on. Here's my come on for this week. Wait. What? I thought you were just doing come on, and now it's turned into cr- come on cripes. I, the- there's three of them. I give out three awards, three three awards a day, a, a week. I give out a come on. Yeah. I give out a, you got to be kidding me. Oh, brother. <laughs> I should give out a, I should give out an old brother. Uh, I should give out an old brother. You, uh, you can come up with the old brother. So I got to come on. I got to, you got to be kidding me. And I got to cripes. <laughs> and these all came out of my experiences this week. All right. So I think it's, you know, I, I, I want to, I want to throw them into the, uh, I want to throw them into the good and, and, and into the, you know, into the, uh, into the radio listeners' ears, and, and if and if you uh, and and so so this is also part of my um, my, my things are just right because you know this is a religious radio that's not quite right, and so I try to say, well, here's some things that are right. So anybody who doesn't you know make these things happen today, because these have been working me up all week. All right, two of them have to do with the telephone, and I was on the telephone a lot this week. You know, I do a number of things in my life, and it puts me on the telephone a lot and calling a lot of different people. And uh, so I, these two of these have to do with the telephone. And for those of us who use the phone a lot, I think that these, you know, these, these start to wear on a fella after a while. And if you're having a long week and you're driving back from Fargo in the middle of the morning. Hopefully with your earpiece in. Yeah, hopefully with my earpiece in. Yeah, I, I use my earpiece all the time. It's just hard to text with your earpiece. No, you're not supposed to text when you drive. I don't text when I drive. So here's the come on. <clears throat> the come on. It's all of you who use a call tone. A call tone, if you don't know what they are, that's when you call somebody and instead of hearing ring, 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 it plays the song that the person you're calling wants you to have to listen to. Drives me oh. crazy. Because sometimes these ringers on people's phones go on for 25 to 45 seconds. Like quite often, it takes me a minute 15. I look at my phone, it takes a minute 15 seconds from the time that I hit the, the call the person button until I can actually leave my message right so that drives me nuts to begin with but these call tones so i call somebody and then i have to listen to their selection of music in my ear and it makes it makes me just say come on so if i call one of you good listeners you know for some reason and i start with a come on it's because you have one of those call tones now you have to pay for that first of all so i know you got to buy those things for like 99 cents or a dollar bad recording of it but that's a ringtone. So oh. a ringtone is when someone calls you, the sound that your phone makes so you know someone's calling. That's called a ringtone. Okay. That's so that you, and you're the only one that has to hear that, or the people around you, they kind of look over at you and say, mm-hmm. hey, great ringtone. A call tone is what you as the caller hear in place of ring, 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 ring. So, I, I mean, this kind of stuff that I've, that I've had to listen to, it just. You, you got know, a list of those songs? Oh, no. I don't even know what any of them are, which is what bugs me. You know, I mean, I guess if it was, you know, if every so time. So everybody I... who's listening who cares about you and who would potentially get a phone call <laughs> to further. This is what I would do to further please. bother him. Oh, see. Get some rap see. on your call oh, tone. That's, that's what it is quite often. It's um, it's 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 a it's a hip hop tone of music that just makes me feel old. So that's probably what it is, is that I just feel out of out of touch. No, you're just crabby. And out of date. And I'll tell you, but, you know, you if you. You know, you put a little Bruce Springsteen on there, that'd be fine if I have to listen to 35 seconds of that before I can leave you the message. But sometimes I get myself so frazzled up by these people's call tones, I, 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 I forget what I'm leaving on the message. I mean, that literally happened to me this week. I'm listening to this song, and I'm like, it bugs me so much that the person, you know, then it went to the beep, and, and I was just still thinking about how much it bugged me, and I realized it was 10 seconds into it. Wow. It was just, so I had to hang up and, and call back and then act Sorry. like, and then act like it didn't, didn't go through. So the big come on of the day goes to those of you that have call tones. Seriously. Nobody, what is life people coming call, to I, that you I, have I don't, a call I don't want to rant. And I, I know don't I'm little, even know. And I know I'm a little saggy-eyed this morning. Oh, my so gosh. So maybe I'm particularly crabby. Take a but deep I wrote, breath. But I wrote this one down in the middle of the week after that 10-second, you know, 
brain stall out that I went into because I had to listen <laughs> to some somebody's call tone. Um, it just seems so. I mean, look, I, I know that when it's somebody else's phone number and it's theirs, and if I'm going to call them, it's sort of their business. You know, they should be able to do whatever they want. But exactly. Just in common courtesy, could you get rid of the <laughs> could you get rid of the call tones? Oh so anyway, boy. Yeah, I know. It drives me nuts. All right, now I invited you to stay around here, you know, to, to help me on this, not to, not to... All right, so the you got to be kidding me. The you got to be kidding me this week is also phone-related. And it goes to the people who have the companies where when you're waiting on hold, they say to you in a pre-recorded message, they say, we're experiencing unusual high, high call oh, yeah. volume, and that's why you're on hold so long. Look, if it was unusually high call volume, you wouldn't have a pre-recorded message put in the loop Listen to, to play. Hey. If, it, if, it, if, it was, if it was really an unprecedented amount of callers, someone would come on and go, hey, we're just getting slammed over here. Just keep hanging on a minute. It's a pre-record. The reason I'm still on hold is that you don't have enough operators. I it's, have a better I, one. I have called, I've called places when they're closed, and been put on hold and had them say, we're experiencing an unusually high call volume. Like, no, you're not experiencing an unusually high call volume. It just it just kills me. Now, okay. I got one more, but you, so, so you go this into week, this. This week, I did the same thing. Mm -hmm. I was calling the county. I had to do a whole bunch of insurance stuff. Yeah, all right, come on. This is my and, I only got a okay, left. Yeah, so on. not only you're, we're you're experiencing um, a whatever high call volume, call back later. Hang up. So it just cut you off. It just hung up. It just said, we're experiencing an unusually I, high call volume. I was volume. sitting in the dentist with Ruben, needing to make an adjustment. Like, if you know well enough, companies, that, that you have to pre-record a message that could play, that you're so frequently getting an unusually high call volume, it's no longer unusually high. Now it's a normal thing that you have a pre-recorded message to play on, and it, it just... It and guess just, what? And, and I know that I'm just like, no, just to own up the fact that, like, you know what, we're trying to cut costs so we don't have enough operators around here. Just say that. Don't come on and say your call's really important to us you don't even know what i'm right. calling about how would you know it's important to you and then we re so uh, anyway i called it sort back of drives me crazy yeah, i so called, back, you called back and uh, i was the fifth caller that's it you're the fifth caller what do you mean when i called i called the number right back yeah. when they hung up on me yeah and then i got in the queue and i was the fifth caller how'd that you know does, your fifth caller because it said you? you're the fifth caller oh so they weren't experiencing that is not a really, really high volume of calls yeah, if you five, ask me. Five, five people for the county well now we shoot up all the time where you don't get to hear the cripes oh come on uh, I'm One telling you, no, of the no, they come on, and you got to be kidding me. Oh, because, cripes! Yeah, yeah, you know what goes in the old brother now is the fact that my wife chewed up my <laughs> my cripes moment. Or hey, this did. is Doug Padger Radio. We try to talk about all kinds of things, have a little bit of fun, sort of encourage you along the way. So, those of you that are making the world better by using your telephone in proper ways, good for you. Religious radio, that's not quite right. AM at nine fifty. DougPadgerRadio.com. Hey, we'll be talking to you next week. One hundred and sixty-six hours. We'll do it again. Thanks for being with us today. Talk to you next week. This